Hey everyone, Eddie Gray here with thepipenook.com. Coming to you from the West Parlor here in Gray Manor. Wanted to uh, start another series that hopefully I can keep rolling uh, called Pipe Nook Tips. And this is what I'm smoking right now. They gave me the inspiration to uh, make this video. This is my uh, Big Ben Bora series pipe. It's a 9mm filtered pipe. And you can see I've got it tamped down after my uh, first light. And uh, uh, I should have left it for you to see, but this was fluffed up about an eighth inch, maybe a quarter inch above the, the top of the rim. And that's no good. And I'll tell you uh, what I'm smoking in it is some of this right here. I just opened this up. This is a um, three and a half ounce tin of Peterson's Signature Flake, which apparent, apparently is a straight Virginia. Um, but when you open it, or at least when I opened it, it smelled citrusy. It smelled kind of um, more so than a typical bright Virginia wood. And I thought, man, this is topped with something that I'm not going to like. Because I'm not really a fan of Aaron Moore Flake or anything that's kind of citrusy. Uh, topped but when you light it and smoke it it doesn't taste like that at all so when they say that it's non-aromatic it's just topped with something very subtle to kind of um, accentuate uh, what the Virginias bring to the table they really mean it that's exactly what this is so I would recommend the Peterson's uh, signature flake um, but here's what you don't want to do <laughs> here's the public service announcement don't do what Eddie don't does. Um, what I do is I take a flake, I rub it out. I almost always rub out my flakes. And so I have a big mound of uh, pipe tobacco and I want to shove that whole flake in a pipe. And, you know, I don't know what it is. You know, you'll just have a little bit left and you want to shove it in the pipe. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I've done it so many times it's ridiculous and um, if you feel like your pack is right don't screw it up by putting in the last bit of that flake um, because you'll mess up your draw um, this isn't quite as bad as it could have been or as it has been in the past so I'm going to relight it But yeah, it, it could be very detrimental to your entire smoke. So if you have just a little bit of flake left, don't worry about it. Put it back in the jar. Like sprinkle it down on one side of the jar. By the time you're done with a, with a tin of flakes, you might have another smoke or two down at the bottom left over. Maybe three. And that's fine. Smoke it then. Don't don't ruin your current smoke. Mm. So, that's my tip for the day. Pipe Nook tips number one. Glad y'all got to see me today. And we'll chat with you later.